right? That didn't hurt as bad. It hurt. They're getting tight though. Hey goodies, welcome back to my channel. Here I am just a few months ago getting my impressions taken. This is the current state of my teeth before I've ever had Invisalign. And this is what it looks like. I don't know what they call this. And then here I am the day of, which is probably like three months later, actually getting my Invisalign installed. I don't know if you can see, but they put these little nudges on my teeth to hold the inner the line in place. I can't really see them, but I can feel them. I have a lift now. I have a lift. I have to talk like this now. So I got Invisalign yesterday. And I just want to know, why the fuck nobody told me this shit hurt so bad? Like, this shit hurt so bad! My entire face hurts. Like, I have a cold right now, and I just, I can't handle it. I can't handle it. Bro, free me from my misery, please. Somebody, anybody, please. I've been up for like three hours. I still ain't brushed my teeth because I'm afraid to take them off. Because every time I take them off, they hurt so bad. So, and then I have to wait like 30 minutes until they feel a little normal to start eating. So that's already 30 minutes wasted because I only got two hours out the whole day that I can't have them on. And then putting them back on is equally as excruciating. <sighs> I'm going to do the bottom first because the bottom doesn't hurt as much. <laughs> I'm scared. <sighs> okay, see? That didn't hurt at all. Oh my god, it hurts all I do. There's something in the back of my mouth. Huh? There's something. Oh, is it swollen? It's so swollen. I care. Like, you can't even touch. It's swollen. Oh my God, it didn't hurt half as much as it did yesterday. <laughs> no, son. No, son. No. <laughs> Yo, I'm fucking dying. Yo, like, I just took them out and it feels like I can really like pluck my tooth out. Like, it feels like this shit is holding on by a string. I can't even bite down that shit hurts so fucking bad nah I'm about to die bro I can't do this shit I, I need a refund bro this is fucking excruciating my teeth hurt so bad that I was unable to chew and oatmeal was the only thing that I would have been able to get down so I ate that for breakfast and then now it's time to put my trays back in the killer. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. Goodies, I was in so much pain. I literally laid here for hours until it was time for dinner. I've been trying to eat. I barely ate a salad because one, my teeth fucking hurt. Two, I keep biting the side of my cheeks. And then three, these little stuff that they put on my teeth are cutting up the inside of my mouth. This is not fun. I never play with my food. Like, never. I never play with my... 
Shadi. You okay? Want some chicken? I can't eat as well. Someone might as well have it. Let's give it to, oh, this piece has salad dressing. I don't think he can eat any of this. This stuff has stuff on it. I'm sorry, Chevy, you can't have any. I'm giving up. I've been trying to eat for the last 30 minutes. This is as far as I can get. We can try again tomorrow. Not tomorrow, we gonna try again later because it's only five o'clock. Year day three, here goes nothing. I'm putting my liners back on after I took them off for about 45 minutes to eat. I think this one is the top one. Yeah, no, no, no. It says lower, it's an L. Okay, huh. the bottom ones don't really hurt. It's the top ones that, huh. That, oh God, I can feel it already. I did the bottom ones and I can feel it already. Oh my God. So I watched this YouTube video last night and this guy told us that you to take them off without feeling pain, you should open them wide and then after you open them wide, then just pull it down. So when I put them back on last night, that theory really didn't work. I'm gonna try it again today. Oh, I'm scared. Yo, this is about to hurt. Oh. <laughs> All right. Oh, I just numbed myself with some, some Ambisol. I need to take a seat for this. All right, I gotta do it. I'm gonna just do it. <laughs> All right, it's not gonna be that bad, I promise you. Cause, oh, this morning when I woke up, my teeth didn't hurt at all. I just felt pressure from the actual aligners being on, but I didn't feel any pressure. So maybe this isn't going to hurt as bad as it has hurt in the past. <laughs> okay. Uh. Ah. Okay, that's not as bad. That's not as bad. That didn't hurt as bad. They're getting tight though. Oh my god, it's starting to hurt. Ah! So it didn't hurt going on, but now as time is going on, it's just getting tighter. It's not, it's not. <laughs> oh no, it hurts. I'm gonna tighten. I'm gonna hide. I'm gonna put on the AC. No! Cause I wanna do the catch. Yeah, I can eat that. I gotta be real. This is how bad this shit hurt. I have fucking ice on my fucking mouth. I'm fucking dying. I'm so happy. All right, goodies, so I definitely couldn't take the pain anymore. And after taking painkillers and still being in excruciating pain, I went ahead and went right back to my orthodontist office. Good morning. So today is day number four. Not including the day I got them done. No, 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 including the day I got them done. Today is day number four. As you can see, I am happier than I've been in my previous days, but it's like 10 o'clock, nine something-ish. I just, I woke up, I took them off, I brushed my teeth, I ate, and now I'm about to put them back on. It's been about 45 minutes-ish, so I hurry, gotta hurry up and get them back on, you know, spend some time. So I'm gonna put them back on today, and let's see how much pain I have. Before I go ahead and put them on, I'm gonna put some... <laughs> I still have a baby on. I'm gonna go ahead and put some Aura Gel on my gums to kind of numb the pain a little bit. Cause you know, I don't I don't like feeling pain like that. Yeah, so I'm gonna put some Aura Gel on. I'm gonna take a Q-tip. Matter of fact, I'm gonna put a shirt on cause I need both of my hands for this. So yesterday was day three. Um, I ended up going to the orthodontist because one of my attachments on the bottom came off and other than that i've been in excruciating pain so i was just like let me go up there and ask some questions 
See how my trays may be, excuse me, maybe my trays are misfitting of some sort. I made it together. Let me finish telling you guys about my experience at the dentist yesterday because when I went there, um, they kind of like laughed at me saying that I was being a baby. Da, 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 da. And I didn't feel like I was being a baby because I couldn't sleep. And then yesterday when I got home, I didn't do anything but sleep for a solid maybe 14 hours because I was in that much pain. So they didn't do anything but give me some wax. They didn't give me any of those chewy things. And they just told me to take a leave in Advil. That was it. They said, baby girl, if you switch to braces, you're going to regret that. Because this is going to be... It's going to be a lot more painful than what I'm currently experiencing. Sorry. One of my attachments came off. And I don't think that's supposed to happen. Especially just a couple of days after getting on. But she gave me an option if whether I wanted to put it back now or later. She was like, oh, I, I can put it back at your next appointment, which isn't until May, which is kind of a long time from now. And I was like, sis, I'm feeling so much pain. If it's not going to change the progress of my teeth, nor, you know, let's just hold off. So I held off, like, reattaching, like, that reattachment. I think I'm on it right now. I'm going to just go ahead and put the trays in. This tastes so fucking nasty. Yeah. Okay, time to put these on. This morning when I woke up, I actually wasn't in any pain, but I did take an Aleve before I went to bed. Not that I think that an Aleve is going to last me through the night, but I do feel like my teeth are getting somewhat acclimated to the trays. So with that being said, I know I'm being a punk, but I'm gonna just put these trays on because it's going on an hour at this point and I just need to put them back on before it's just gonna be so much more painful. And plus I need to eat later on today and I'm using up all my time because you're, you only technically have two hours without them on for the entire day and I'm going into my I'm about to reach my first hour now. So I'm wilding I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and put in my bottom ones because the bottom ones never really hurt It never really hurts initially. It's like five minutes after that you're like, oh nah. These are the top ones I never want to do this. Like, that ing, ah, ah, God, I never get used to that shit. And so first, it it never really hurts. So even with the Orgel in, they feel extremely tight. Uh, ooh, like every time after I put my, my trays in, at least my top tray, well, they're always in together. So at least 30 minutes after I put my tray in, I have to take like a 30 minute hiatus and just go sit down, meditate, because my entire base hurts. I have a lisp, as you can see. Yes, my entire base hurts. Like all of this hurts so bad. <laughs> And it's stressing me out. Like, even with the aura gel, I can still feel a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of pressure. And, ah, it hurts. It hurts. This is why I try to not keep them out for a very long time. But now it's time to go get my day started. All right, goodies. Thank you so much for watching.